Matt Lenehan, Boxing Social in association with Empire Fight Store. Delighted to be joined by British Commonwealth Champion. You told us it had happened. It's happened. Just give me your initial reaction to what was just an incredible night here in Barnsley. Just a lot of, just a lot of gratitude and, and pride, you know. Proud, proud of my town, proud of my team and my club. And um, yeah, it's just amazing, mate. Amazing. Just talk to me about the initial words when they say and the new. Your family was there, you shared a moment with obviously your girlfriend, your dad, trainer. Yeah. Was it like a relief? Just just describe it because it, it, it seems such an incredible moment for you. Not so much a relief. Listen, I knew this was going to happen. I knew I was going to win. Um, I visualised this many, many times and it was exactly how I expected it to go. Well, not to go, but exactly what I expected it. Walking out there, the atmosphere and the new. I've, I've already, it's already happened. It happened weeks ago, it happened months ago. Um, but, you know, the real thing was tonight and, you know, it was just it was great. Great. Was he was he better than you thought he was in that time? Um, I think, in some aspects. Yeah, I, I think it was maybe myself maybe underperforming a little bit. Um, but I think boxing it wasn't. I'm trying to think how to describe it. Yeah, I thought it was good. Not not. I thought it was going to be easier. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, give him respect. Res, give him his respect. Yeah, we're better than I thought. Going backwards and, and with his head movement. Yeah, we're better than I thought. Yeah. It was quite. Um, you hit him with a great shot in the first round. I thought when you hit him, I thought this this could be it kind of thing. Did you get that sort of that rush to say, you know what, he's hurt here? And did you think you're sort of in the ascendancy? Because I could see it in your eyes as soon as you hit him. It was like here we go kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. You know, I know that I carry power, um, but I think sometimes I don't really sit down on my shots. I like to throw punches in bunches. I mean, someone like Chile, I'll, I'll let him, I'll let, I'll let him get close and hold, and I smothered my own work and um, let him fall in. But yeah, again, it's a, like I said, this was this is a learning fight for me. This is a stepping stone fight, and it's not overlooking him. Yeah, I'm looking past, I was looking past him, but not overlooking him. But you know, every fight's a learning fight. Every day's a school day, and I've got a lot, a lot more to improve on and show. You didn't have masses and masses of amateur fights, like you know, you see all the guys coming from the Olympic setup. Zach's been at this level for an awful long time, and if you don't come prepared, if you don't do the rounds like you do, I know you train for like 15 and you're you're in shape, you can slip up against a guy like Zach. Yeah. Is that, did you feel that in there? The fact that you know sometimes you know punches were slipping by, but you were still having the best of it. Yeah, definitely, definitely. You know, caught me a few decent shots, but. It was he was exactly pretty much exactly how I expect in terms of like, we've done some film study on him, you know, I've had Mark Marley in the gym, the Barnsley Data, Barnsley Football Club data analysis team have, have helped me out doing some data analysis on him and we knew ex everything he did, we, we drilled and worked on it was exactly what we expected. Um however, yeah, they should, I should have they should have done a bit better in, in terms of my performance. Isn't that quite exciting the fact that I think people were saying that you won the fight convincingly yeah, yeah. you've got the belts you've got the hardware and, there's, I can't carry <laughs> and you've and you've still got so much more to come there's so much to improve on and you've and you've still done it convincingly yeah listen like i said every day every day is a school day and um, you know obviously we're gonna we won that's the main thing but we've got so much to to improve on we'll watch the fight back um and yeah I'll be back i'll be back in the gym monday working on stuff got no injuries and uh, yeah I just want to touch on this crowd. I mean, the noise before you came out, even before the ring walk yeah, was, yeah. I've not heard anything like that for a long time. It was special. How excited are you for the fact that, you know, once you can eventually open more than one stand up, you could have this place absolutely bouncing. Listen, I am so proud to be from Barnsley. So proud of everyone that's come out to support me. And yeah, the, the, I've never seen atmosphere like that ever. I've been to, so other than the, the sold out 21,000 shows at Manchester Arena, you know, I've never, every stadium fight I've been to, I've never seen, even when it's been a sold out, say I've never seen the atmosphere, they turned out proper, proper tonight. And yeah, massive thank you to everyone that come out to support me. They trust me, the bigger, bigger nights to come. This is just the start. Calm Simpson, always appreciate your time. Um, you. Thanks for letting us have a lot of access no in camp as well. And yeah, yeah. we'll catch up soon. Thank you very much. And then you, thank you.